Hello everybody and welcome back to No Man's Sky. I am Alon Paul. And as you know, I am doing, as you can tell by the title, a nanite video on farming using the pirate systems instead. So you've probably seen recently, I've put out a video regarding curiosity deposits. Well, we want to do pirate stations because we're curious as to whether we can make the same kind of, of uh, nanites by trading in a pirate station. So I'm, I'm here right now because I was testing out some theories. I'm in a pirate station at the moment. And one of the best ways to go about doing this is to basically set up a network of pirate stations that you can go to. Now, in my case, you can't go to any of these because obviously it says clearance not granted. But if you scroll through your list of stations that you've been to in the past, you're going to find that there are pirate stations you've been to. And you can go straight there if you wish. So we're going to get on our way. Now, if you set up a network of these things... You can jump from station to station to station to station to pirate station to just work away around the network. They will repopulate the goods within about 30 to 45 minutes. So what we're going to do is we're going to do one station. We're going to time it. We'll jump to another station as we're timing. So as we arrive to the station, here we are. We've just arrived. I'm going to go up to the trader over here in the corner. And we're going to get ready. And I'm going to go ahead and start the timer right now. And we're going to see what this does. So here we go. Timer going. We get in here. One of the main things it says to do is to purchase all these so you can make your money back after you sell stuff. Now, I've got plenty of money, so I'm not worried about it. Don't worry about getting the goods. The goods don't help you. But if you get the tech, that's what you're looking for. Okay? Get the tech. Don't get anything else. If they got larval cores, too, you can purchase those because those will give you nanites. So go ahead and grab them. All right. So what you can do with those is you're in here. We unpack. I wasn't trying to install you. Get back over there. And there you are. So you'll see I ended up with this. This is going to give us some value out of it. And we ended up with this, which we can sell. And we got these, which you can turn into nanites. So I'm just going to put them down here for now. We got all of these here. So you can see that we're spending a little time doing it. So we'll, you know, we'll adjust the time a little bit. And as we sell them, you'll see I've got 184,068 right now. We're going to sell what we've got. Let's get rid of all these. And hang on a second here, 184,068. And the difference between that and the 187,437 is 3,369 nanites. That's the best I've done so far, to be honest with you. 69. Because the last station I only made it about 2,000, a little over 2,000 nanites. And what you do, go on to the next station and do the same thing. Now, you could jump in your ship and go look for another pirate station if you wish. Or, you can come back here, scroll through your list real quick, and look for another station towards the bottom of your list. That's a pirate station. Here's one right here. So, this is the next one over. So, we're going to call this about a minute and a half. Those are the explanations I put in here. And we'll see if we can't get... I think I've got at least a few pirate stations in here. So, we'll see if we can't... See how many we can get done here. Now, whether we hyperspace over there or we do it this method, this still takes time. Okay, here we are. On our way. Back over to the trader. Pick them up. And we're going to buy, again, we're going to buy all the illegal goods, which we want to sell in a regular system to get our money back. Arms and tech. Ooh, we've got a lot here. That's good. Anything else? Larval cores? I'll go ahead and grab them. And we'll go ahead and sell those later. So let's unpack those real quick. So here they are right here, right? Put more down here. There we go. Okay. Okay. And we'll open that one up. Go over here. Sell these real quick. And sell. There we go. And there we go. Now, I failed to record the earlier number, so I can go back in my video and I'll check it, and I'll put the numbers down there. So, we'll figure that out in a second. That was kind of dumb. Go on to the next one. So, you'll see that in the description, or I'll have it on the screen when I edit my video. Space stations. I'm going to scroll all the way down to the end of my list again. I'm going to look for the next pirate system that shows up. There we go, right here. Let's go. So we'll get that second number here in a moment. I'm going to write down my nanites this time so I remember. And we're there. 
Come on. There we go. And what are we? 194.74, right? There we go. And I took an extra few seconds, so no big deal. We'll do it fair. Don't worry. Okay. Here we go. I'm going to grab all this contraband again to make my money back that I'm losing when I purchase everything. I'm going to have a lot of fun getting rid of this stuff. And we're going to get the four suspicious and the seven tech. Anything else? We do have some larval cores. I'll go ahead and grab those. And we'll unpack. Here they are. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, four, and five, and six, and seven. And we'll go ahead and open that. That gave us something neat, and that gave us something neat. 19506. You'll see I got a little bit of nanites out of that. 19506. And we're going to sell all these off. But we're going to use the other number because of the ones that we just made. Okay, real quick. So 193, 682, minus the 19474. Gives us another 3200, 3208. Okay. And we're done. Let's get out of here. We're at about five minutes right now. Let's do one more. And we'll politely call it six minutes. And we can do the, you know, multiply by ten after that. As long as you have all the stations set up that you can get to them all. There we go. Right there. A lot of multi-tool upgrades here, so make sure you're not in multiplayer when you do all this, by the way. Okay, almost there. Like I said, we're going to call it six minutes total because of the delays I made on this. So we know we're around five minute mark because of all the delays. And we'll be done with this video in just a second. Good old cue ball. Here, there we go. And we'll take that, take that, take that. Let's go down here. We'll take all the larval cores, arms, and tech. Done here. Open them up. Six, one, two, and three. It looks like we got all tech this time. We're at 193, 682, right? Ninety-three six eighty-two, and that gives us thirty-six hundred nanites. Thirty-six seventy-eight. It gives us this time. So we'll call it stopped here. So we're going to say it took us about six minutes to do all this, right? Just to go to those stations. So the numbers are starting to look really good. Now, if I take these guys in here and go to my, I don't know why he doesn't show anything in there. He should have. And I put them in here. So we'll just grab some real quick just to show. Okay, we're going to get 500 nanites out of those automatically. So let's say I got two stacks of them. We almost have two stacks anyway. So that's going to be another 1,000 nanites on top of it. And we're going to automatically say that at that other station, we got at least 3,500 nanites. It seems on average that's what we're getting, about 3,400, let's say. So all total, let me put these numbers in. Uh, let me see, plus 1,000, plus 3,208, plus 3,369, it's that number, and then we're going to add to it, we're going to add automatically 3,400 extra nanites, just to play it safe, because that's a good average. That gives us just shy of about 15,000 nanites, 14,655. Let's round it up to 15,000. I think that's generous. So 15,000 nanites is what we did in just six minutes. So we'll do the math on that, we're going to multiply that by 10, and what do we end up with? 150,000. That's right. You can make upwards of 150,000 nanites. Now, here's the thing. You've got money that's going to come out of your account here, your units. You're going to spend a lot of units on this. So you're going to want to sell these things off as quickly as you can, and you have to sell them in a regular system, or else you're not going to get your money back out of them. You can make a lot more money that way, too. Where's my ship? It's over here. And you definitely don't want to be scanned by the authorities. So we're going to go ahead and take my solar ship here. And I'm going to go into hyperspace right now. And we're just going to go to the nearest system real quick. This looks pretty good. Yeah, it's not a pirate system.
And this is what I recommend doing for yourself too, is to go to a regular system, sell off all those things, but go straight to the space station. Do not pass go, do not collect $200. Straight to the space station, or you will go directly to jail. Basically, you'll be attacked by sentinels pretty quick. So this seems to be a really good method to make them a very, I would say a much better method than curiosity deposits. And probably right now, I would consider it my second favorite method. Only reason I would consider it second, even though it makes a lot more nanites, or it appears to, um, the only reason I say it's my second favorite is because, well, there's no killing of sentinels involved. And I'm a little sad about that. But that's okay. That's okay to each his own. If you really want a good method of collecting nanites without having to fight sentinels, this is definitely your best method. So, we're going to just go over to the trade terminal. I don't mind destroying the economy over here a little bit. All right. And you'll see how much these things are valued at it as we get in here. Uh, so when we sell, uh, where'd we go here? Let's see if we can find our bad stuff that we have in our inventory. Stolen DNA. See? Half mil. Easy. Uh, what else we got? We're looking for anything that has purple text on it. There it is, smuggled. 2.7 million there. And nip nip buds, 91,000. Smuggle contraband, another million. Oh, there it is, huh? Blood salt, 10,000. 565,000. 1.5 million. Counterfeit circuits, 887,000. And it looks like I've just peaked out as well. So it looks like I'm not going to get any more. I'm going to go and sell off my larval, larval cores because I don't want them in my inventory again. Okay, we're just about at a maximum. So that's pretty good. We got this as part of the things we opened up. 967. And I don't think... Let me go ahead and sell this off. Yeah, it doesn't make a difference. We are now back to our maximum amount of units in our inventory again. So it really didn't make a difference. So there you go. All right, so we'll go ahead and call this done. And I appreciate you watching this video. Again, the comments section below. You know about it. Please hit the like and subscribe if you liked what you saw. And definitely hit some comments. Tell me what you think. 150,000 nanites an hour. I mean, that's pretty good. That's a pretty good uh, run through. Um, let me just check my inventory, make sure I'm clear. Uh, that's my ship. Yep, we're clear. We're clear. Nothing there anymore. So that, I think, is a really good method of getting nanites if you really want to collect some and get some going here. So... Uh, I recommend it highly as the best method, nonviolent method of getting them. If you just like taking out sentinels, well, you know my earlier methods that I've showed you. So let's go ahead and say goodbye on this video. Thank you very much for watching, and we will see you all next time. Take care, everybody.